This is a Ram optical sprint system. Very, very easy to use. Turn the power on to the crosshair generator, monitor. We'll need to turn the bottom illumination. Bottom illumination on so that we get nice shadow. We'll need the top illumination. Adjust it to where you're happy. I've put a penny on here to do a simple circle, simple circle measurement. Very, very easy to do once we have it focused here. I'm simply going to press the circle. I'm going to go through. I've lined the one crosshair up. I'm going to select that, enter that as my first point. And let me find another spot on the, on the penny. Very simple, I just line the crosshair up with any other point, hit enter, that's two points. You can do multiple points, you get a better me measurement, but I'm just doing three points just to do very simple. There's another point here, I'm getting the bottom shadow on these. I'm going to put enter and finish. And there's your diameter of the circle. I did it very quickly, it should be 0.75, but I don't... My, my first measurement wasn't right on. So now I will go to quit. I'm going to zero all my points. I'm going to show you I have a Joe block here. A Joe block that's uh, what I have set up. I'm going to focus a little better on that. This is your, your Z, as you can see. As I turn the Z, the Z is moving here, going in the upward. I did measurement already with the Z. Bring it over to the edge. One edge here. I'm going to give it all zeros. Zero each each one of the the axes, the x, y, and the z. Line it up. I'm simply going to move to the other end of the Joe block across my penny. The other end, and it's simple, 2.89. That is exactly what it says on the side of the Joe block. And what we'll do here is I'm going to do a measurement the, in the Y axis. I'll come over here. I'll zero my Y. Just press that simple zero feature. Go across, nice and easy. Right across, 1.5 inches, very simple. You can do circles, angles, lines, different coordinates. There are a lot of different features on the QuadraCheck. You really need to read the manual, it's very simple. The crosshair generator here is very nice too. There are multiple features. You can change the color of the lines. Multiple lines. You have two sets of lines that you, you can do here. You change the colors of those lines. You can have them serrations. You can set them up different ways if you want to do different crosshairs to different looks. You, know, you can do both of them that way. You can set up the line, the line size. However you would like to do it so you can and you can take multiple points. This is programmable also. Okay, very simple, nice color camera. Top and bottom illumination so that you can get shadows or just the top illumination if you just want to use the look at the top, the top of the surface. Very, very simple operation. Z-axis, you can see the Z-axis here. It does measure. And that's basically all of the functions. Very simple operation.